Tyler O'Neill in the middle of the batting order kind of happened around when this run took off. I mean, the, the season you're putting together, is that just getting enough reps and suddenly feeling it and, and putting it into action? Yeah, sure. I mean, um, you know, this is really the first year I've had a full season under my belt to, to figure some stuff out, um, you know, go through ups and downs and, um, you know, be able to make those those adjustments that, that you that you need to make that are necessary to make over a consistent 500 at bat. So really, really figuring out, um, you know, how, how my abilities work in this league um, and, you know, how to counteract, you know, what different pitchers do and stuff. So, um, you know, feeling good up there. Being the number three hitter and hitting between the guys you're hitting between, I think can be a little intimidating, but you flourish there. How have you done? That? That's pretty cool, isn't it? Um, you know, Goldie, Nolan. These guys are two of the two of the most renowned hitters in the NL over the last decade. You know, I've said this a couple of times, but um, all, all I'm doing is learning. You know, I'm, I'm just trying to learn from those guys, and they, they give me such good intel. Um, you know, here or there, uh, you know, it's just, it's, just, it's just a great experience for me to, to keep playing ball, and uh, obviously it give me some good protection too. That, that helps for sure. One of the guys who has been running wild and has letting his feelings be known uh, demonstratively is the guy you play next to, Harrison Bader. How much energy do you get off him? Because that guy seems like he's constant energy. Yeah, definitely. No, Har Harrison brings it every day for sure. Um, I can't say enough about that dude, obviously. Uh, you know, he's uh, he's electric in the field, and uh, he's, he's got, uh, you know, so much ability at the plate too. So, um, you know, he, he's dynamic out there, and uh, it's, gr it's great to have him on our team, of course. Do you think other teams are paying attention to what you guys got going on? I'm talking about playoff teams that are thinking, yeah, I'd rather avoid those guys if we could. Definitely should. Um, you know, 17 in a row now. So, um, you know, baseball's a funny sport, though. Anything can go your way at any time or the other way at any time. So, uh, you know, we played a lot of good, consistent ball, throwing strikes, hitting strikes, um, you know, doing the little things, moving guys over, hitting low liners and stuff. So that's how we're cruising. Keep it going. It's been fun to watch. Thank you, Jimmy. Appreciate it.